Stuart writes, there's no doubt fishing is big in the U.S. I should know as I live 40 minutes from one of the best fishing lakes in the country, Lake Gunnersville. Ski and kayak fishing has become, have become commonplace here lately. Um, American... American fishermen are are slowly getting into jet ski fishing. Uh, we're seeing it pop up around the country, but again, it's it's a slow burn. Australia is a California wildfire. Aust- uh, the Australians are so much so that Yamaha sells a dedicated FX that isn't found anywhere else, and. Uh, jet ski fishing is just going to be huge. So now that we have this new Fish Pro Apex, we have the, the Kawasaki Jet Angler or the Angler, um, and then Australia has the Jet Fish model of the FX, which I'm hoping to see next year, but we'll probably end up seeing something ridiculous instead from Yamaha next year. Um, who knows? But uh, it'll be curious to see how jet ski fishing in the U.S. expands and grows. Yeah. And, you know, I might give it another shot. I've done it a couple of times and it was miserable. But, you know, the, the jet ski fishing industry has come a long way since then. So I might give it another shot. I might enjoy it. I doubt it, but we'll see. Well, <laughs> Not that it's not really fair because your your fishing experience is uh, on yeah. some very nice center console boats offshore. Yeah. So, well, um, yeah, a little bit different. Yeah. I don't think I would take a Sea uh, trophy out into the out into the Gulf. Oh no! The, the see, I think jet ski fishing is better, you know, offshore than it is inland. And when I've tried it, it's been inland. And my, my biggest pain was, you know, there's current in these canals that I'm fishing in. You've got no trolling motor. Uh, and, you know, you turn it off, fish in a spot, current takes you down someplace, get up in the, in the trees, got to start it up again, move, you know. That was my biggest hurdle that I didn't like about it versus a bass boat. You know, you throw the trolling motor off, you get a, an anchor button, hold you where you want to be. So, I mean... The potential's there. I wasn't a fan. I understand why I saw people do. I don't know. Maybe I need to give it another shot. Right. Hey, guys. Thanks for hanging out. This clip was taken from our weekly podcast that we record here every Sunday night at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. If you want to watch the whole video, you can go to the Watercraft Journal's YouTube channel, go to Playlists, and then click on Live Sessions. You're going to see it there. Otherwise, go ahead and leave a like, a comment, and definitely subscribe to the channel. It helps us grow. And again, thanks again for watching our videos, and we hope to see you soon.